Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. So recently, I have been catching up on the YouTube videos. And I've been catching up on Peter Lindgren's recent travels to Canada, where he meets all the other different YouTubers, and in particular, where he meets Peter McKinnon. And Peter M makes Peter L try a different type of coffee. Now, we all love, or especially I love coffee. So any new reiteration of coffee, I got to try. So I'm going to go grab the ingredients, come back to the studio and try this coffee, which Peter Lindgren made me drink. So sit back, relax and enjoy the video. Okay, so we are back in the studio from the kitchen and we're going to make this coffee which Peter McKinnon made Peter Lindgren drink. Now, I think it's a bit wacky and out there, but let's nonetheless give it a try. We have all the ingredients here right on the table. So we have a shot of coffee, we have a slice of lemon, they used a wedge, but I'm sure it's going to be the same. And we have a glass full of tonic water. Now, it's basically a tonic coffee with lemon. Sounds crazy, but let's give it a try. So all we do is we take our coffee, ooh, which is still hot, our glass of tonic. So let's gently pour this inside and hope it won't make a mess. Now, the one they had was kind of separated. I'm sure if you pour it slowly over a spoon because the tonic has sugar, the coffee will stay on top. But the froth is there. It's pretty nice, as you can see, almost like a Guinness-like froth. And then we'll take our lemon slice and we'll chuck it in there. And that's as difficult as it was. And if Peter McKinn explained it, it's tonic water, shot of coffee, and some lemon. So let's move this out of the way. And let's try this for the first time and see if it's actually real. Well, I'm sure it's real because we saw it in the video, but if it's any good. Let's smell it first. And it's almost like the tonic cancels each. It's almost like the tonic cancels out the coffee flavor. You get, you get a bit of both, to be honest, depending on which way you look at. So, nevertheless, chairs bottoms up and let's give this a try. And that's pretty good. It's bitterness of the tonic coming through. The natural sweetness within the tonic water sweetens up the coffee. Not too sure about this. Um, residue that's formed here on the top this kind of white foam but it is pretty pretty refreshing and you know what definitely definitely give it a try because it tastes pretty good so if you've made it or if you've tried this before or if you're going to try it and know what it tastes like put it down in the comments below otherwise try it Give it a try. If you like coffee, you'll probably like this. Put down in the comments what you think. Don't forget to share, like, subscribe, and I'll catch you all in the next one, buddy. Goodbye for now.